bone joints and muscles. You remember 12 system in a human body, more important for you, it's a using uh, anatomical terminology. Anatomical uh, terms, it's a very important uh, information and some uh, terms without knowledge of the terms, science itself is unknown. Uh, correct name uh, or structure, uh, it's uh, very important for you and for your future. Um, in this page, I sent now in the chat uh, this link, present terminology in the four languages. First of all, it's a Latin language in all worlds. Uh, first column, it's the same uh, in all world uh, structure and name uh, organs in a Latin language. Uh, Ukrainian, Russia, and English present in this is web, uh, pages and you can use and find some information in uh, this is page uh, Nomina Anatomica in the website, but now uh, new uh, classification of the um, human anatomy, it's uh, three main parts um, with five uh, main parts. First of all, it's a general anatomy. Today we speak about uh, speak about uh, locomotor apparatus or systemata musculoskeletalia. Uh, it's a bone joint and muscle. Next, uh, third part, it's a uh, splanchnology. It will be after one week. Uh, we are starting of the digestive tract and all organ, internal organs. And uh, first, in <coughs> integral uh, systems and second, integral system. So, uh, musculoskeletal apparatus. Why apparatus? Because three, two or three system together, it's a uh, correct name, apparatus. And uh, bones, joint, and muscle, uh, more popular terms in the English version books, it's a musculoskeletal system, but uh, system, it's a skeletal system. So it's a skeletal uh, articular system and muscular system. Together, it will be a locomotor uh, apparatus or musculoskeletal apparatus. Um, three uh, sciences of uh, for studying uh, these uh, systems. It's uh, osteology uh, about bones, arthrology about joints, and myology or about muscles. Uh, in the human anatomy, starting in the bones uh, and in a uh, different other system, very important moment, it's a numbers, numbers of the human anatomy. What does it mean? Uh, you know, in a skeleton, uh, totally, it's a 206 bones in an adult. And uh, this is 206 bones in adult uh, delayed in a different uh, uh, parts uh, in a uh, different region. For example, it's a um, regions uh, and bones of the skull, vertebral column, uh, uh, thorax, upper limb, and lower limb, and different numbering uh, bones in this is region. We will talk. To, uh, uh, we will speak about this is moment in the next time too. Um, different uh, location uh, body of human body in a different ages important too for uh, some <coughs> uh, special flexing uh, of the human bones and other structure in a human body. Locomotor apparatus. Uh, consist of active and passive part. Active part it's a, a myology or muscles. Uh, passive part it's a bones and joints. But without moving of the muscles, uh, absent locomotion. Locomotion it's a uh, mo moving in a space. Uh, and function of the skeletal it's a biological uh, function and uh, mechanical functions. So. Uh, bones. Bones form the skeleton. Uh, 
provide a level of for the muscles, uh, protect the organs, uh, store minerals such as calcium and phosphate ion, pro, uh, produce blood cells by means of uh, bone marrow. Uh, some cavity in a, uh, and fossas in a uh, skull or in a other structure, uh, it's a special fossas and cavity for different organs. And um, different part of the skull, for example, it's a different surface and uh, uh, in a skull present <coughs> Uh, brain, for example, and uh, eyes and other organs in a, a special uh, spaces between uh, maxilla and mandibula and other. Uh, cavity. Cavity. Uh, some bones pre uh, have uh, a special air space and it's a, uh, as a name, it's a sinus. Uh, for example, in the maxilla present Hymor sinus or maxillary sinus uh, with air, big Persian air uh, in uh, this region. So um, all the bones of an organism united in a bone system or skeleton or, or uh, skeletal system, which is uh, usually called skeleton. The term skeleton uh, comes from a Greek word uh, meaning Greek dried up uh, and skeleton uh, consists of with axial skeleton it's a skull vertebral column a thorax and uh, appendicular skeleton it's a bone so the upper and lower limb if you look in a number of the bone uh, axial skeleton it's a only 80 bones uh, 126 bones it's an appendicular skeleton uh, why? Because big Persian bones and smaller bones present in a uh, manus and uh, pedis or in a uh, hand and uh, leg. One bone is not con connecting with this old skeleton, it's a hyoid bone. And uh, hyoid bone, it's uh, uh, located uh, in a, a neck region and uh, connecting with the larynx. Uh, some differences between male and female uh, bones uh, and skull. You looked uh, and understand it's a male, oh, it's a female. Uh, next one, uh, X-ray of the skull. It's very in important and very interesting a part of the human anatomy. I now sent in a chat to, to you this link. And you can use it to, uh, when you prepare into the practical lesson, these pages with big version of the X-ray examinations uh, e images. Next, <clears throat> here in a skull present four sinuses, frontal sinus, phenoid sinus, ethmoid, and maxillary sinus. Maxillary sinus is the biggest sinus. As a name, uh, scientists who opened this is sinus, it's a gymor. Gymor, uh, it's a uh, inflama uh, inflammation mucous membrane of the maxillary sinus. As a name, it's a gymoritis. Gymoritis because gymor, it's a sci scientist who opens this uh, sinus. So, <coughs> uh, not only skull uh, have different form in the male and female in a. a, a totally skeleton have a special form in a pelvic, for example, in a uh, thorax. And in a pelvic, you know, uh, it's uh, some uh, sizes uh, and uh, distance uh, between some structure in a um, uh, female uh, uh, pelvic, uh, very important for uh, time when present uh, fetus in a uh, in a uterus. Uh, the skeleton of the uh, torso of various monkey and human. You looked uh, some uh, structure very same and uh, some classification of the bone uh, about long, brave, uh, uh, short, planum, irregular and pneumaticum. Pneumaticum, uh, I replay four bones with uh, ear or uh, for pneumatic bones in the skull. It's a frontal, ethmoid, sphenoid, and maxilla. 
and uh, totally different number of bonds in a different uh, animal. For example, in a dog, 320 get uh, 250 uh, peak uh, 216, uh, and in a human, it's a 206. Uh, different bone in a different region uh, have some uh, different function and big um, uh, for example here it's allocated femur fem, uh, tibia tibia it's a uh, all the uh, uh, bones of the lower limb and uh, uh, when in this position uh, this is bone uh, one thousand. 650 kilogram we present and press to this is bone. <coughs> Very strong uh, structure in a skull. The skeleton, uh, uh, for the convenience uh, of study, the skeleton uh, divided uh, into yeah. axillar and appendicular uh, okay. parts. Yeah. Uh, uh, and uh, axillar skeleton, I replay. Uh, we looked uh, total schematic and now axillary skeleton skull uh, spine and rib cage or thorax and vertebral column. Yes, skull it's a cranium in the Latin language. A big portion Latin terms and Greek terms uh, will present in your uh, study in human anatomy. And please uh, remember this is terms in the future. Appendicular skeleton it's an upper limb and lower limb, uh, including shoulder girdle and pelvic girdle. Uh, motion is alive and time to time we will uh, stop to the, uh, for example, break and uh, please uh, all time when you can uh, stand up moving in a room where you're sitting now, uh, make this. The axillary skeleton uh, consists of 80 bones, skull, uh, auditory ossicle. It's the smallest uh, bones in the human body and these bones, three bones, uh, not changing uh, during life uh, when in a newborn, same uh, size and in an adult. <coughs> Avoid bone, one bone located in the neck, vertebral column, and thoracic cage. Um, appendicular, it's a uh, upper limb and lower limb. Bones as an organ, what does it mean? Uh, organ in a human body, it's a structure with um, all, every organ have structure, function, vascularization, innervation. And 206 bones in uh, skeleton uh, <clears throat> during uh, a few weeks, you will know 206 organs, but only structure, this is organ and function. Uh, uh, next time you will study in uh, and for example, information about vascularization and innervation different region. So, um, structure of the bone and structure of the periosteum. Bone is a one of the hard structure of the uh, human body. It uh, uh, very important for uh, connecting with internal organs and uh, with uh, integument too. Uh, stages of development of the skeleton, it's a connective tissue, it's a membranous. Uh, second uh, stage, it's a cartilaginous. And third, it's a bony. Uh, and very important, if you uh, remember now, it's a not um, changing uh, this structure, connecting, not uh, uh, change to the cartilaginous. Cartilaginous not change to the bony uh, tissue, for example. Uh, in a, some structure in a bones, uh, uh, long time present on only cartilage, for example. Next time, uh, located small portion uh, cells uh, uh, of bony cells. Yeah. And 
uh, skeleton, yes. Uh, and next time moving uh, and delayed, this is a bony uh, to all bone. Next time, uh, the bones which uh, go through these uh, three development stages called secondary bone. If three, this is uh, stages, it's a secondary bone. Uh, primary bone, the bones uh, which are formed uh, directly from connective tissue without going through the stage of the cartilage. First of all, connective, next of all, it's a bony, yeah? It's a uh, primary bone. Next, uh, it's a bone, a bone classification, long, short, um, it's a samoid uh, bone, flat bone, irregular, and uh, warming bones, uh, or sartral. Um, it's a, for example, humerus uh, in the upper limb. Humerus uh, with long uh, in a classification. It's a long bone, short bone, big person, short bone present in a, a carpus, uh, flat bone, parietal bone, for example, of the skull, and irregular bone. It's an uh, explanation of the uh, bone, in, bone in a vertebral gland. It's a vertebrous. <coughs> As um, an organ bone uh, consists of this bone tissue for uh, compact tissue and spongy tissue, bone marrow, periosteum, uh, epiphyseal cartilage, vessels, and nerve. And uh, other words, it uh, have structure, function, vascularization, and innervation of all organs. And um, all uh, long bones, uh, for example, have big person vessels uh, and uh, nerves uh, in the uh, uh, internal structure in all uh, lung. Uh, so I looked time to time in the chat and some uh, students uh, sent uh, email uh, PDF. This is lecture after com uh, completing uh, this lecture will present uh, this person in a YouTube channel. And if you find in an atom.ua website, you will find this information too in a uh, special page when present uh, all presentation of the human anatomy uh, in the micros. Okay, structure of bones, uh, bony tissue, compact tissue, and uh, calcinous tissue. Uh, next, uh, bony tissue, bone cells, it's uh, uh, osteoblasts, uh, osteocyte, osteoclast, uh, and bone matrix uh, consists of organic and inorganic. 30% uh, organic and 70% uh, uh, inorganic. Uh, it's important for understanding some uh, function and some structures. This is bones. Macroscopic structure of bone, uh, it's a morphofunctional unit of the bone, uh, is the osteon, osteon or haversal canal. Uh, it's a uh, structure uh, for understanding some uh, locate here, yeah? It's a, uh, some Havers uh, canal, canal and in a, a, a central canal of the Havers located portion of the vessels and other. Here, for example, to uh, Havers canal, uh, some parts with blood vessels and nerves in the internal structure. And big portion information, information about uh, you, uh, internal structure of the bones. It uh, will be present in a course of the histology and cytology. For, for example, here present uh, osteotide, osteocyte with uh, location in a special uh, lacuna and um, canaliculi. After this canaliculi movement, special uh, liquid uh, for this is, uh, cells, for the trophic. The structure of the bone in a uh, different part. Osteon is a structuring unit, compact tissue of the bone. Uh, this is a system of bone lamellas, which are uh, situated around um, the pink or haversal canal uh, and group of the osteons from the uh, from the trabecle. Uh, trabecle is a special structure 
in uh, bones uh, and uh, compact uh, locations. This is structure for important for the strong. Uh, this is uh, organ. Uh, the bone lac lacuners of the spongy uh, tissue and bone scanner of tubular bones contain bone marrow and uh, two types bone uh, medullary cavity with the canal of the bone called the bone medullary canal. And uh, in a bone um, marrow uh, are divided a red bone marrow and yellow bone marrow. The function of the red bone marrow is a hom hemopoiesis. Hemo, what does it mean? Blood. Uh, and uh, the yellow bone marrow, it uh, um, consists of the fat cells. Here you look to yellow bone marrow and big portion red bone marrow uh, in a spongy bone uh, of the uh, long bones, for example, here. Classification of the bones uh, depended on their development, decimal, chondral, and chondodesmal, uh, for example, uh, as a classification. Uh, decimal, uh, primary bone, chondral, secondary bone, and chondrodesmal, it's a vertebra, the bone of the base of the skull, uh, the clavicle, uh, and other. And, uh, General notion con concentration development of the uh, bones. It's uh, in a course of the embryology, you will uh, start in uh, studying about uh, this information too. And some derivatives of the lateral plate mesoderm. It's a lateral plate mesoderm from the, for example, pelvic and shoulder gallows uh, and long bones uh, of the upper and lower limbs. Uh, and uh, next, it's a narrow uh, crest uh, in the head region. It's a uh, uh, for um, creating of the skull bones. Uh, occipital summits and other. Uh, three stages uh, of development, uh, development of the human skeleton. Uh, it's a connective tissue, or membranous, cartilaginous, and bony. I request this information because it's very important for understanding some differences between bones too. Primary centers of ossification. Uh, it's ossification as it's when starting first uh, time location, a small portion bony tissue or, or bon bony cells in, a, um, for example, carpal region and next time uh, very quickly this change to uh, bony tissue. And um, secondary and accessory points of ossification, it's um, points uh, when uh, in a different time present in a human skeleton. For example, here it's a uh, uh, 36, 38 uh, days uh, in a uh, fetus, yeah. Next, uh, it's for example, uh, when you can look in the maxilla, parietal, radius, ribs, uh, scapula, it's a different bones with different number in eight weeks, 11 weeks. Um, in the starting of the uh, in a, uh, 18 weeks, uh, really uh, present the biggest part of the born in a uh, human uh, skeleton. It's in a uh, prenatal uh, period. What does it mean natus? It's a when a uh, child with uh, uterus masochivity moving to the external. It's a 40 weeks after uh, when starting this is fetus uh, located in a so, uh, very important moment, it's a, in a child, a big person connection between bones present and uh, it's, uh, for example, in a skull, a special structure, uh, ponticle. Next one, uh, the bones does not have it stable. Uh, it's a, a very important uh, age, professional difference. 
in the bone structure and, and other. For example, a child with a head press uh, in ancient Peru, yeah, and uh, different form, uh, some uh, skeleton, uh, some uh, skull, uh, find uh, in uh, different time and thinking about maybe it's a abnormal or a special form, but uh, really uh, next uh, next time uh, was uh, find a special structure for press uh, in a newborn child and uh, why uh, this method used because thinking if different form uh, not typical it's a, a special uh, uh, function of the brain but it's really it's a mistake it's a special uh, form for flexible your brain it's a uh, reading books and uh, remembering some information biggest portion and other and thinking about some structure so and uh, for example uh, different forms uh, uh, structure of the penis, uh, podologist, it's a, a special uh, doctor who treatment some uh, problem with the uh, leg and uh, varieties of the human feet, for example, it's a normal foot at flat foot, yeah, it's uh, very dangerous for all organism. Uh, as a variant, it's a lordosis, scyphosis, uh, uh, scoliosis, and in a norm uh, location of the vertebral column. Uh, variant of the fingers with anomaly. It's a not five in a norm, uh, or it's may present, for example, uh, prepolex or uh, digitus minimus. Uh, uh, six po uh, polex and polydactylia, it's a one present uh, more than five fingers. Uh, syndactylia, uh, fingers, um, fingers, uh, and other variant. When may present this uh, moment, uh, for example, with amputation of the fingers, when present uh, influence. Uh, to the human organism, uh, different terot terot again. Terot again, it's uh, some um, very uh, bad uh, convenient to the uh, human body in the uh, fetus, uh, to the burn, uh, yeah. And uh, some disorders, it's a uh, uh, gigantism and uh, dwarfism. It's uh, uh, when biggest person uh, somatotropin hormone uh, with hypothesis of influence to the uh, human body in a different ages. And uh, for remembering different methods, first of all, it's a drawing. Next of all, you can use, an, uh, use uh, some uh, picture. Uh, it's very interesting, I think, uh, for you too. Uh, skeleton perform function support protection body movement hem hemophysis uh, and uh, mineral storage and next time you will uh, in a practice lesson find uh, some bones and classification uh, to uh, for example long bones have uh, diaphysis and the epiphysis uh, diaphysis uh, with central tuft medullary cavity Epiphysis uh, periosteum with external surface, compact uh, bone, also called cortical bone, very uh, dense and hard. And uh, next, uh, uh, some structure with component, with process. Um, for example, common bony processes, it's a head, condyle, epicondyle, trochanter, uh, tubercle, and tuberosity. Uh, if you not uh, understand what does it mean this is structure you can uh, find in the books and look in the slides uh, what does it mean this is structure in a different bones uh, bony processes found the femur for example uh, caput head yes and uh, trochanter here and uh, condyle here uh, for example it's a, a different bones uh, in a picture 
as a variant, you can create uh, or make uh, some bonds with a special plasticine. Yes, you can, uh, you know, and you remember in a ch uh, child uh, used plasticine and you can create in this is bonds and understanding it's a more good remembering for you. Uh, bony depression, sinus, foramen, fossa and fissure. Sinus uh, follow cavity with, uh, within bone. It's a, for example, I replace this information third, per, uh, time, uh, uh, third time in uh, this lecture. It's a fourth sinuses. It's a fourth uh, bone in a skull, uh, frontal, um, uh, etmoid bone, senoid bone, and maxilla. It's a, a two, uh, four uh, bones with special air spaces and uh, as a name it's a sinus frontal sinus at uh, sphenoid and maxillary sinus present in a uh, skull for example here a sphenoid bone in a, a bony uh, body of the sphenoid bone location uh, sphenoid sinus as a variant it's a present fissure uh, fossas and uh, foramen, foramen it's an open here. Next uh, of all, it's a bone of the skull. It's a bone of the skull. It's a big, um, many, uh, many structures of the 29 bones, but 29 it's a, if including uh, bones of the, uh, uh, in the uh, temporal bone, plus uh, auditory uh, ossicle. Frontal, parietal, temporal, uh, next one, uh, at more it's you know, at a capital, bone of the skull, uh, of the uh, cranium, uh, next, uh, facial bones, mandible, uh, maxilla, uh, zygomatic bone, and warmer in the internal structure of the nasal cavity. Palatin bone uh, located near uh, maxilla, nasal bone here, and lacrimal bone in a uh, in, uh, uh, medial uh, surface or uh, in a uh, orbita. Uh, Heoid bone, single U-shaped bone, uh, one bone not connecting with uh, all skull. Trunk, it's a vertebral column and uh, sternum and rib cage. Uh, the vertebral column can, um, divided into five uh, sections. It's a cervical seven, uh, thoracic 12, lumbar five, sacrum uh, five or one sacrum in a totally uh, in an adult and coccyx. Uh, here present, uh, number of the different vertebras in it, this is uh, divisions. So uh, next it will be a rib cage, to, uh, 12 pairs of the ribs touched uh, to vertebral column at the back and uh, provide support for the organs such as heart and lungs. It's a, a big portion uh, respiratory system and uh, part of the cardiovascular system, heart, and uh, uh, many portion, big portion of the uh, vessels and, uh, and nerves. <coughs> uh, true ribs, uh, 10 pairs, uh, floating ribs, uh, it's a two uh, pair, and uh, totally 24 ribs in a, in a rib cage or in a thorax in Latin language. Pectoral girdle, uh, clavicle and scapel, uh, upper limb, uh, it include pectoral girdle or uh, and uh, free upper uh, limb or free uh, upper extremity, the humerus, ulna, radius, uh, carpal, metacarpal and fingers. Uh, Pelvic gadol plus uh, bones of the free part of uh, lower extremity. It's a femoral patella, tibia, fibula, tarsal, uh, and metatarsals. And phalanges totally, it's a uh, lower limb. And uh, main in your life, it's a keep uh, balance. And we now 
uh, have a short break and I hope you uh, will uh, have short uh, gymnastic for your eyes and we will start gymnastic and I will continue after this moment. I already continue or not? Guys. Yes, sir. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. One or two students with video, please. Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. They are. Yes, sir. Your camera. Okay, sir. I replay. If for you not uh, interesting, you can stop and in a YouTube channel find this information. Uh, in a YouTube channel present uh, some uh, and this lecture will be two and I replay uh, link to uh, YouTube channel and link with list for English uh, student to you a few minutes. I will send to you in a chat. And now I find a uh, list uh, for foreign student where present big person information in English. A uh, few minutes, minutes here. And this is lecture in your variant will present in this list too. And I send to you a list by present persons uh, information like uh, Professor Kowalczyk for you. Yeah. So we will continue, dear students. Uh, I hope you have a short break and please stay with video, uh, dear beautiful student who now with this video, staying with video because. For me, it's very important. Uh, I all time look at your emotion uh, and it's for me very important. Thank you. So, second part of our lecture about joints. Or as a name, it's an articular uh, system, yeah? Uh, there are two major types of the joint. First, it's a synarthrosis. Second, it's a diartos or articulation, articulatio, uh, or as a variant, it's immovable joint and movable joint. Only two, only two types of the uh, joints. Please remember. Uh, first, synarthrosis. A bone is united directly uh, to another bone uh, by a very small amount of fibrous connective tissue or cartilage tissue. Uh, Diarthrosis. There are these uh, joints have a fluid uh, filled joint cavity which is enclosed by a joint capsule. Joints formed uh, where two uh, bones meet two or more bones connected, yes? Also called an articulation. Uh, three types based of uh, movement uh, allowed uh, between the bones. It's a synovial, cartilaginous, and uh, fibrose. 
Uh, next, synovial joints. It's a freely mo uh, moving joints, most common type of joint. Um, example is a ball and socket joint. Uh, bones bones uh, held together by ligaments and uh, some contains a bursa. Uh, synovial joint, for example, enclosed in a, an elastic joint capsule, uh, contains synovial fluid and uh, present uh, joint cavity. But this is cavity may uh, look only when crush or cut uh, capsule. Um, contains synovial uh, fluid lubricant secreted by synovial membrane uh, in the uh, internal structure. Cartilaginous joint uh, allows uh, uh, slight uh, movement. Uh, an example, it's a pubic synthesis. Uh, next, fibrous joints allow almost of the, to the moment. Example, sutures of the skull uh, and uh, the subtypes of immovable joint, it's a syndesmosis, synchondrosis, and synostosis. What does it mean, desmos? It's a connective tissue, chondros, uh, cartilaginous, and uh, ostos, it's a bony tissue. Uh, the types of syndesmosis are uh, suturus, ligaments, interosseous membrane, and gymphosis. Syndesmosis is in a fibrous joint or connective tissue, yeah? Fibrous joint, uh, the bones are held together by fibrous connective tissue. There is joints have a joint cavity. Uh, sutura, suturas uh, are found only within the skull. Uh, they are characterized by a thin layer of uh, connective tissue that uh, binds uh, the articulated bones. The type of suturas, it's a serrate or as a name, dentate, dense, the tooth, yeah? Uh, lap of squamous suture and plain suture. Here, for example, uh, sutura squamosa or uh, lap suture. Uh, and uh, as a sutura uh, present in the skull in a different region, for example, here, uh, sutura dentata. Uh, then dentate or serrate, it's a between, for example, frontal bone and parietal bone. Next, uh, syndesmosis type of fibrous joints, united uh, units, uh, the bones with, with a sheet of fibrous tissue is a ligament of fibrous membrane, fibrous membrane, or for example, interosseous membrane in the forearm uh, is a sheet of fibrous tissue the joint, uh, the radius, and ulna in a syndesmosis. Interosseous membrane and syndesmosis, interos radio ulnaris, it's the same, but uh, in a different variant. Next, uh, gonfosis. What does it mean, gonfosis or socket or dento alveolar? Uh, syndesmosis? It, it is, uh, is a fibrous joint. Uh, in which a pack like process fit uh, into the socket articular between the root of uh, the tooth and the alveolar process of the uh, jaw. Mobility in this is joint, a loose tooth, uh, indicated pathological stage affecting uh, the uh, supporting tissue of the tooth. Uh, for example, here, yeah, it's a maxilla. Uh, you remember name, this is cavity. What is this cavity? I'm waiting in the chat your answer now. Please, what name this is cavity? What is the sinus? What is the bone? Please, uh, I'm waiting in the chat your answer. Here. What is the bone uh, and uh, what is the sinus? No. Maxillary cavity, but not maxillary cavity. It's a maxillary sinus. Sinus. Maxillary bone with maxillary sinus. It's a big sinus. Uh, it's a section, but uh, in this is section, very good. You looked in a located uh, nerves uh, for innervation. Uh, 
piece of the um, maxilla uh, or uh, upper line of the uh, teeth and uh, it's very important because if present inflammation in this is uh, sinus it's pressed uh, this is liquid to this nerve and pain may present in the uh, teeth too okay uh, and very important in this variant, it's an X-ray examination during uh, visit uh, person with pain induced uh, to the stomatologist. So the types of the synchondrosis, you remember three variants. It's a syndesmosis, synchondrosis, and synostosis. Synostosis are primary, it's a temporary or permanent, and secondary. Uh, Symphysis are present uh, where two bones uh, adjoined directly by solid. This is a fibrocartilage. For example, pubic symphysis, pubic symphysis here. It's a not a uh, joint, it's a not a uh, real joint, it's a not articula articulatio articulation. It's a uh, small uh, cavity may present in uh, this is cartilage but it's a not uh, articulatio because absent uh, capsula and cavity. Uh, as a variant, it's an intervertebral discus. Yeah, uh, why present this is, uh, in this structure discus? Because uh, surface of the uh, body of the vertebra and um, form uh, when connection one surface uh, with fossas, other with um, external surface and <coughs> for a good moving and uh, stay uh, intervertebral discus. Uh, when um, growth is complete, uh, this is the same uh, uh, chondrotic joints, ossivity or synostosis next time will stay and uh, are not longer vis uh, visible. For example, of the sacrum. In the sacrum, it's when uh, five uh, vertebrae uh, together will stay in, in a one bones in a sacrum. Um, next variant, uh, different connection, for example, in a temporary in a, a sternum. And uh, the most uh, worst type articulation is the body is a uh, freely mobile synovial joint. Synovial joint, um, types of the synovial joints, it's a plate uh, joints, uh, hingle joints. Um, plain, uh, plate, uh, plain uh, joints, it's article surface uh, flat and a low shot, sleeping in leading movement and intercal carpal in and intertarsal uh, joints. Uh, final uh, joints, it's a, a cylindrical protection of the of, of uh, one bone uh, fits into uh, through shaped surface in another and like a hot dog uh, in bun. Next, it's a pivot joint, pivot joint. Uh, uh, rounded, ended, and uh, of one bone uh, pro protrudes uh, into the ring formed by another bone um, or by ligaments uh, from uh, that bone, proximal radio ulnar joint, for example, and atlanta axial joint, uh, it's a pivot Condylo Condyloid joint, uh, oval structure, oval structure, um, uh, articular surface of the uh, bone uh, fifths. It's an into uh, complete entirely uh, depression of uh, another bone. It's a radio radio carpal bone joints uh, and uh, meta carpophalangeal joint. Uh, next variant, next type of the uh, synovial joint. It's a, Little joint, each articular surface has convex and uh, concave areas. Uh, 
for example, carpo metacarpal joint of the thumb and the wall and both uh, and uh, socket uh, ball and socket uh, joints. It's uh, for example shortened hip joints and present a special uh, process and uh, structure uh, to connection with this is moment. Synovial joints, the most common type of the joint, provide free movement between the bones. Uh, the join, uh, they are joints of locomotion, typical uh, nearly a limb, uh, all limb joints. Synovial joints are the, uh, it, for, in Latin language, it's, it's articulatio, uh, are composed in uh, fibroelastic joint, capsule, articular cavity, articular surface, and synovia. If absent one with this for uh, structure, it's a not real joint. It's a not synovial joint. It's a not articular. So uh, synovial joints are enclosed by a fibroelastic joint capsule, uh, which is uh, filled with a synovial fluid. Um, its uh, fluid will be connected with uh, surface with cartilage in a uh, structure in a capsule of the joint and uh, connecting with uh, other bones. Uh, ligaments help to uh, bind uh, the bones together in a synovial joint. Uh, and may be located within the joint cavity or and outside the capsule. And uh, ligament different form, it's a long shot in the, in the capsule, intracapsular ligament. And um, for example, uh, it's a ligament of the uh, uh, head of the femur. Uh, next, it's a uh, Classification of the joint. Uh, it's a simple combinated a compound, complex and uh, combinated. Complicated, combinated, simple and complex. Simple joint is a composed with two articular surface. It's a, or other variant, it's a two bones connecting. Yeah. Uh, complicated uh, joints is composed of three or more surfaces or three or more bones uh, together. Complex articulations, uh, synovial joint, which have uh, uh, features as such as fibrocartilaginous articular discs or menisci in a cavity of articulation and uh, which are present um, when articulating surface of uh, the bones are in uh, congru uh, con congruous. Uh, what does it mean congruencia? It's a when present one uh, surface with fossa as a surface present same form and this connection. If not uh, norm, uh, for example, uh, between uh, vertebras, uh, discs and menisc, for example, it uh, will, will present in a complex articulation. And combinated, combinated some uh, separated joints uh, that move only together at the same uh, time. Uh, for example, it's a temporal mandibular uh, joints when moving in a one uh, right, uh, in a left, uh, Moving to other variant, it's a, a radio uh, ulnar proximal and distal uh, joints uh, will moving in a one time uh, together. And kinds of the synovial joint, uh, synovial joint are classified uh, in the six main types according uh, to the structure, the moment and pay, the uh, permanent uh, I replace the gliding hingle pivot, condyl, sandal, saddle, and uh, ball and socket uh, variant. Uh, so it's a different type in a 
total picture and uh, joint uh, motion uh, review of term. It's a flexion, extension, uh, dorsiflexion, plantal flexion, adduction, abduction, inversion, aversion, uh, big portion uh, information about this moving. Uh, uh, I will send to you a link where you can find some videos about uh, especially for joint and you can use when you will prepare into the practical lesson and understanding for example it's a flexion extension uh, in a uh, cubity joint and some structure in a um, internal cups uh, in when present articulate so it's a capsule so we will uh, uh, liquid uh, uh, articular surface and it's a, a really a moving may present in this uh, joints. So uh, for example here it's a when protraction retraction are present in a uh, mandible uh, present moving in the right and left region of the temporal mandibular joint. And um, for classification ligaments uh, example, it's a uh, articulatio uh, when uh, cutting skin and uh, delayed some structure, it looked uh, present in, in uh, intracapsular uh, uh, ligament. Intracapsular ligament, uh, when uh, it's a discus, uh, meniscus uh, present uh, in, a, in the cis joint next time uh, only bones yeah and uh, capsular uh, joint uh, uh, consists uh, of in the capsule and extra uh, capsular uh, uh, ligament sorry uh, not joint ligament it's uh, uh, not connecting this uh, capsule Capsular ligament uh, moving to the capsule and uh, connecting uh, with bone after this is moment. Uh, I replay uh, very good if uh, really uh, good physical training will be uh, present in your life because when uh, absent uh, big portion of the physical training, it's a uh, may present some problem with uh, joints. And uh, for example, here, this joint with problem in the uh, cartridge. Yeah. And uh, now, um, dear students, we very uh, quickly have information about uh, muscles. Muscles, it's an um, active part of the uh, locomotor uh, apparatus and uh, locomotion it's a moving yes uh, and uh, muscular system uh, main function it works with the skeletal system uh, and uh, articular system uh, to provide uh, produced a voluntary movement help to uh, circulate blood and uh, move food uh, <coughs> through the digestive uh, system and have structures uh, skeletal muscle uh, smooth muscle and cardiac muscles. Uh, smooth muscle uh, located in a uh, digestive tract, uh, internal organs uh, occurs in the walls of the internal organs, is a involuntary cardiac muscle, has striated, branched, and uh, uni. Uh, you, you need uh, cleated fibers and occurs in walls of the heart. Uh, is involuntary, same with smooth muscle. But is voluntary, it's a skeletal muscle, muscles uh, and uh, has striated tubular multi nucleated fibers is uh, usually attached uh, to the skeleton and uh, uh, not sitting all long time, uh, all uh, time moving because uh, it's very important for creating your uh, totally understanding in this is world too. Uh, well, for example, this one right here. Uh, 
more dangerous uh, it's when we long time will sit in near a uh, laptop and now it's a other position it's a position with smartphone but big information uh, with smartphone uh, and different uh, social networks um, make, uh, have uh, result this one yeah and uh, not only information and uh, not healthy food if present it's very dangerous so uh, different form uh, size in a different ages uh, in a human body it's very important for understanding uh, ages uh, part of the human anatomy and uh, okay. uh, next it's uh, uh, um, longest name in uh, anatomical terminology it's a uh, sacus uh, sacus recto musculus sternocleida mastoideus cellular recessus lateralis gruberi. Uh, you can uh, you will find uh, this structure in a human body in a next time. Uh, physical training for organism it's a, a good relax after big person studying in your. Uh, in this is time for you for physical training physical training uh, it's a two very good so different form muscle uh, around form long uh, and other and uh, all uh, muscles have uh, uh, a special structure in a musculoskeletal anatomy types it's a tendon and ligaments Li ligaments connect bone to bone and tendon it's a, a muscles connecting to the bone please remember this is moment too and uh, muscles it's a mouse does it mean head uh, body and uh, cauda it's a present in a mouse too and uh, it's very important and please uh, the uh, nadis cesa don't stop studying and studying very good 